Greetings, my brothers. Chaplain Gwimbo Victorious here. And I regret to inform you that a terrible event happened. I was attempting to carry on with my eternal quest to see my brothers off their penitent. However, the entire fabric of the universe became corrupted around me and was destroyed by the machinations of chaos. However, thanks to the power of the Emperor and some mysterious man in black armor calling himself Cypher, I was able to be traveled back in time to the start of my brother's penitent so that I may once more attempt to return my brothers to their former glory in the, in the light of the Imperium and our Emperor. And I invite you all to join me in my eternal quest to see my brothers through their trials, no matter what, and no matter what fate befalls of us. And I invite you all to join me. For those we cherish, we die in glory, brothers. Okay, translating that into English, uh, for anyone that was interested, welcome back to the Lamenter's Redemption. And, uh, yes, a few little things happened. I've been attempting to do this video for a few days, actually, and unfortunately, my save file is completely corrupted to the point of near uselessness. However, as I always have a bit of benefit of hindsight with these things, I had an emergency backup, which was about half an hour behind the previous version. Unfortunately, that one completely fucked out too. Actually, even worse than the original, um, believe it or not. It completely crashed the window and completely made the save unplayable. So, I've been forced to restart the Lamenter's Redemption again. Which... Kind of a bummer, but also I like to think of it as an opportunity, because this time, as we're doing it, we're far older, far wiser. You know, I know not to engage orc threats head on, and not, you know, to act like I'm my entire chapter's on a death oath. I've learned to be more mature and more wise, and I honestly think that together we can get through this. You know. Like, I'm not going to start attacking extreme orc worlds, for example, but I can attack moderate and sparse worlds, you know, keep uh, keeping in spirit of the Lamenters and fighting and protecting the innocent, but actually getting off their penitent and not being a douchebag and charging in, as I said, like I'm on a death oath. And this time, we're going to try and woo the Ecclesiarchy and, you know, get ourselves a bit of a good cred with them, get some Sisters of Battle to help us out. And we're going to recruit more artifacts, get more men, get more equipment, and get these guys off their penitent. And I might actually even create three emergency backup saves just in case. And I reckon we can get this all done. So, I invite you all to join me. Now, I've bought a few weapons and equipment before I started recording. Combi flamers, flamers, storm bolters, melter guns, plasma guns, etc. Bionics, as usual. However, I'll do all that off micromanagey crap off screen because I know none of you want to see me sift through menus for five hours. Alright, what have we got? I've got all of my recruited all of my vehicles. Why wasn't this planet Exterminatus? I thought Fulgrim's World would have been Exterminatus, but no matter. Right. His sword. That's an interesting name for a capital ship. And the Blessed Star. That sounds a bit more Lamenterish in my opinion. Right, three. Uh, where is this Orc War Boss based? Oh, Tyranid forces. Always Tyranids, isn't it? Ancient ruins discovered. Eldar! Uh, um, I don't know what the Lamenter's standpoint on Eldar is, but my personal standpoint is I don't want to get my ass handed to me, so... We're going to investigate these ancient ruins, and none of you saw anything. Understand? Fourth Company! Explore the ruins. I was anticipating this would happen, that's why I sent a full company. 400 cultists! Why did only two LAS cannons open fire in the first barrage? That's better! Cripes, it's like, what was that about, lads? <laughs> oh shit, heretics! Only two las cannons fire! Oh well. Oh, that reminds me.
reminds me, how many attack bikes do we have? I'm going to make 4th Company my official fast attack company. Well, we got 40 bikes! Oh, 4th Company can be definitely be the official uh, fast attack company. Do, 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 do. Sorry, I said I wasn't going to do any more tactical micromanagey shit on screen, but let me have this one. <laughs> tactical Marine Donald! <laughs> Oh, uh, makes me laugh. Right, that's three full squads. I can do one more. Do 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 Reequip. Bike. Boosh. Here we go, fourth company. You are now the official fast attack company of the chapter. Congratulations. I hope you will serve the emperor proud. Uh, what do we got over here, actually? Uh, okay, we can't really take on an extreme Orc Horde. However, we can take on all of these other guys, and hopefully chip away at these guys. I reckon we can get this done. Alright, brothers. Oh, That's a good point. Uh, destroy it. Ooh, jump pack. Nice. Psychic Hood. Ooh, Chief Librarian gets that one. Uh, no, don't want Chaos. We're not having demonic entities. We're not having demonic entities on my ship. It ain't happening. Also, I hope we have a few uh, articles to butter up the... Librarian! Skiff! How many... How many demonic entities do we have on this ship? I don't allow demons on my ships, you know. It's very much against the em Emperor's ideals. Bloody criping McBollock Burgers. In the name of Sanguinius, what are we doing with so many chaotic artifacts? That ain't right. Seriously, like nine of our artifacts. I reckon we'll only have like two or three artifacts. How am I going to butter up the Ecclesiarchy with like two artifacts? What the... All of these... I only have two artifacts that aren't infested with demons? Donnell, Chief Librarian Donnell, what the hell are you collecting down here? And why am I very much concerned? That shit makes me miss Chief Librarian Summerfield. He was a good guy. But that was another uh, dimension and another timeline. So we cannot get bogged down in this. Destroy. Uh, bloody demonic artifacts. <laughs> Seriously. It's just... Oh my gosh. We need to go artifact hunting. Uh, Consta. Bloody hell. Bloody hell, me old ducko. Not doing too well, are you, in this front? Good thing no one's died yet. Wow, out of the 12 artifacts I had in my hold, all only two of them were uninfested by demons. Donald, what the hell are you doing down here? Okay, let's go deal with these orcs. Dun 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 dun. Uh, we're not, we're gonna denounce you. Yeah, frick off, orc. The Lamenters do not deal with savage barbarian orcs that impress and enslave and devour imperial citizens and threaten the humanity and stability of the world. We do not allow it, we will not allow it, and we will destroy you. Right. Okay. Orc Force Sparse, Orc Force Tiny, attack. Full strength attack battle, brothers. Perfect. Sven! Sven! What the hell was that about? Now I have to do new librarian projects. Bloody hell. I've already lost one marine. I can't afford to lose many of you. Alright. Orc forces are decreased. Right. Uh, recruitment. Uh, we want 
Apothecary and Psyker training up. We don't. Tech Marine sluggish. Chaplain training slow. Space Marine can't do recruit. Yep. Nope. I'm perfectly happy for that. Uh, also, we will probably. Uh, I probably will give you, Donald, the. Um, the Psychic Hood. Even though I personally. F well, more because you deserve it more than anything else. Equip. And the jump pack might give that to the chaplain, captain of first company or something later on. We'll see who proves themselves. Right, uh... All threat extreme. I don't want to do attack them, but then again, I really do. And that's more for my co close combat son of Sanguinius warrior prowess at work more than actually wanting to get the chapter off their penitent. Because I don't like leaving orcs alive. It abhors me. I hate it. Disgusting, vile, orc things. But anyway. Wait, I only have one chaplain? Wow. Actually, the reason I was coming in here was I'm going to promote you to the first company chaplain. Going to promote you to the fourth company chap apothecary. Not chaplain. My brain is somewhere else. <laughs> Why was I the one sent back in time to save my chapter? It's obvious that my, my brain isn't working right now. I think it was the time travel. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. We'll come back and deal with those guys when we've got some more vehicles and equipment to help us out. Right. Alt for extreme. I don't want to take on extreme orc hordes, but then again, I really do. Wait, what? What? Where has the, the ship come out? How did I lose a frigging ship already? Well, that's the typical luck of the lamenters, I suppose. Oh, Cygnus Prime. Nice. Didn't think it was an ice world, though. Didn't think it was orcs on it. Oh, they're at Bloody Tau. Ugh. Oh. I was hoping to be free of those weeaboo space communists for a playthrough, but it appears that the machina machinations of fate prevent us otherwise. What was on here that I was missing? Oh, Tyranid forces. No, we cannot abandon forces to Tyranids. That's just not right. Go back there. <laughs> Man. Chaplain Gwimbo Victorious today is being an idiot. Okay, what do we got? Heavy, heavy, heavy. How many vehicles do we have? Well, actually, that's a good thing. We've got, we can get a few more vehicles. We can get some more Predator tanks. Five Predator tanks. Some more Whirlwinds. Hmm, I'm happy for that. Tell you what. Heavy turn and fret. We'll give it a go. And we'll help out who's got the highest civilian population. You guys do. Who has the highest defense force? You guys do. So we'll help these guys. Right. Remove the unwounded. Right. How many men were wounded? Oh, I need to do my traditional buying of more bionics, it seems. Ooh, didn't think it was we needed that already. Okay. Maybe this wasn't the most smartest idea in the universe. Nicholas! That's better. Good work, Donald. Two whirlwinds and a land speeder. Okay, well, that's not too bad, considering. We can probably recruit those numbers. Now, who was the idiot that lost all his equipment? Nicholas! Right, what have you... What have we got to give you? Give you a bolt pistol. Oh, I don't just gonna give him a bolt pistol. Alright, uh, power sword. Bolter. Do we have Mark Six Corvus? No, nope. we have Mark Seven Aquila. Psychic Hood. And a jump pack. There you go. Congratulations. I've given you new equipment. 
I hope you're proud. Right. Oh, that reminds me. Oh, we don't have enough money to buy. No, we have enough money to buy bionics. Why am I... Uh, apologies, it's like 10 o'clock at night and my brain isn't working. Okay. This is more of a nice fight. Oh, cool. Excellent. <laughs> now, armamentorium. The tradition of my brothers. Buying bionics, bionics to recruit our, recoup our numbers. Who is wounded? Usually, devastators. Why is it devastators? Seems like an odd thing to... Right. Add a couple of bionics. Who else is wounded? Devastators? Why? What is it? I expect assault marines to be wounded, not devastators. Oh, the demon fighting on the ship. Of course. And I don't have any more bionics. Because I'm a poor waif of a chap there, aren't I? Right. Okay. Full strength attack. I'm not being stupid. I know where I can win these fights. I'm not abandoning the ideals of the Lamenters just because I'm on the penitent. And I'm trying to play it balanced. Donald! Okay, I deserve that. Ah, oh, fucking hell. I deserve that. That was me being a dickhead and wasting men and equipment. Those nine devastators are my fault. I apologize, my brothers. And I will promise not to fail again. And what is it with my chaplains, my librarians being dickheads? Last, last new life, before I got sent back in time, my librarians were the kick ass. Seriously, Summerfield would just rip shit up with his psychic powers. Oh well. Um, right. You want a force weapon? A. Uh, Mark 7 and a jump pack. Also, I didn't actually give you a power sword, did I? I didn't give you a force whip, but I gave you a power sword. Very rude of me. There. Right. Okay. Well, we've got 7 gene seed now, so I suppose that's something. But we cannot be a dickhead and run around getting ourselves wiped out. And I've already lost enough vehicles on stupid assaults against uh, Terraners that shouldn't have happened. So we're going to play it more safe. Right. Are there any, any artifacts or anything we can go get to make ourselves better? Walk Force is extreme. We'll go down there, actually. We might go pay them a visit. Right. And then, all right, battle brothers, we're going to wisely crusade on the edge of the Imperium, and not get ourselves caught up in any more internal strifes and problems. Ooh, an artifact! Yay! Um, I'm actually going to send you two down on the planet to collect the artifact. Nice. Um, are you still on the planet? No, you are not. Uh, we're identified in four turns. No, I don't. I'm not using requisition on artifacts. I don't need to. Um, what is this orc fleet doing? Um, I don't want to actually get caught up in that orc fleet. Sometimes the game just glitches and the Orc fleet just hangs out in orbit. And sometimes they end up just being in, you know, actually there. And if you go fight them, you end up having to fight them. So, since we lost this... Uh, there. Since we lost an escort vessel, which I'm hoping will re return from the warp at some point, uh, we're just going to carry on. 
Ooh, SDC. Sisters of Battle. Greetings, sisters. A uh, librarian. Ugh. Oh, you... This bollocks again. Ugh. There's bollocks again. Keeps happening. Also, recruitment. We're going to make the recruitment... Apothecary recruitment faster. Because that we need them. Oh, well, STC fragment. That shall cheer us up. Oh, he's on Mars. Nice. Um, yep. Take the STC fragment. Cool. And let's identify it. War gear. Yeah, that's what we want to see. Oh, no discount on bionics. That's lame. Uh, oh, there is actually a discount on all the other weapons. Chain axes have gone down. Storm bolters have gone down in price. Plasma guns gone down in price, which is good. Ah, no, looking up. Things are looking up for the lamenters. I'm not going to touch that with a ten thousand foot pole. Ah, uh, I don't like playing it safe. It's not me. I like annihilating the enemies of the emperor, not hiding from them. Oh well, we'll go up, go up to the north. Find one of their militant arms dealing with militant power armor. Ha! Huh. Well, we shall praise you, sister of battle. And we look forward to working alongside you, sister. And together, spreading the word of the Emperor. Ooh, tactical marine Rex of Fourth Company. Nice. Uh I know you're up for promotion, but I'm gonna keep you in Fourth Company for a while. And no one can wear Terminator armor yet, which is disappointing. However, on the bright side, I can afford five billion sets of bionics. Yay! I really want the war gear discount. That means I can get cheap bionics because I end up using a shitload of these things. Oh, actually, that also reminds me, we can restock our supply of rhinos. Perfect. I always like having some good rhinos as, as kill shields. I am not touching that orc fleet under any... I don't care if there's a, a relic terminator armor suit there. I ain't touching that. Also, I'm not going to be able to fight these guys because... Orc Presence Extreme, even with a full chapter, three orc worlds of extreme that automatically regenerate fleets every turn. That ain't happening. I'm going to have to focus on what I can do. Nothing there. Uh, what's Ronvo like? Oh, Orc Force Tiny. Well, we can go take them on. I don't like being a pansy. I like, I like killing. I like fighting. I don't like this cowardly hiding. That's why I wouldn't make a good raptor or reasonable marine. I'd probably, I'd probably make a, a good blood angel. I'd hopefully like to be a good lamenter. A good chaplain of the Lamenters. That would be the best role. Alright. Let's go deal with some Tyranids. Alright. Oh, I am gratefully appreciative of how much requisition I'm getting. Oh. Hello. Uh, greetings. Actually, wait. Um, let's let the Inquisition do their inspection. Which they have. Which is good. And we shall use our new fancy bionics we bought. I'll probably actually need to buy some more, believe it or not. I'm more addicted to bionics than the iron hands are, aren't I? Right. Well, at least unlike the iron hands, I'm not obsessively killing my own flesh. I do it to augment my troops and encourage them, encourage the strength of their flesh through the bionics as opposed to the iron hands which do it because they're freaking weird and hate their own flesh. Even though Ferris Manus himself actually said flesh is strong. There's actually a quote about Ferris Manus where he complains about how his iron, his hands, his iron hands aren't actually his own hands because 
Um, they were actually the hands of the Necron Beast he killed, and everyone seems to have forgotten that. But, you know... I mean, think of how much the Ultramarines don't listen to Gilliman's personal quotes about the Codex being only a guideline. I mean, they fucked that up pretty royally, didn't they? Oh, getting these guys back up to 100%. And fourth company, my fast attack company. Right. Do, do, do. Oh, well, that's not too bad. A few more bionics and we'll get them back up into shape in no time. Right. Apologies, I said no more micromanagey crap during my um, opening statement, didn't I? Just ended up going way over the bound of that one. Right. Perfect. Now we have all we need to deal with these Terranids. What are we getting? 36 spikes, 2 land speeders, 10 psychers. Oh, 11 psychers. Well, that's... Ugh. Also, I can't believe I lost 4 bikes. 4th company, you should really be better than that. Oh, that's better, Donald. Nice, killing 4 lectors, good work. See, this is what we need to see. And once I finish in between parts, cu kitting out all of my marines with their, you know, customary las cannons and heavy flamers and multi melters and stuff like that, they'll be even more of an effective killing machine. Perfect. Right. I think we might just attack these ancient ruins and then end the part there. And then next time, we can deal with all these lovely Tyranids and maybe go into the central sector and deal with some orcs. We don't want the orcs getting a foothold, do we? There's still plenty of the galaxy left as Imperium, but the more the merrier, I say. And hopefully we can get some a good some good artifacts from this. Right. Fourth company. Good. Fourth company has two apothecaries. And go explore thy ruins. Oh, okay. Oh, that was anticlimactic. I was hoping to have a to get some fancy relic from that. Oh well. It's all good. That's what happens sometimes in the days of the Imperium. It's not all battle glories and death oaths. Sometimes you just gotta do your job. So yes, from my on behalf of myself, Chaplain Wimbo Victorious, I thank you very much for journeying with me in this adventure back in time. And I hope to be with you all again next time. Man, that ending sucked.